Finally, we bring you the I Tell You How of one of the deadliest weapons on television. Nickens Bat, Lucille. The character from The Walking Dead. With this bat that took the life of Clinton Abraham, he remembers his wife. And now I tell you how to do it. There are four steps, and in this first one you will need four rolls of toilet paper, a roll of paper towels, wider than toilet paper, masking tape, scissors, paper, and a plug. Now we start. We go with the handle of the bat. Because this part is narrow, this toilet paper rolls that are small. If the large roll measures 40 centimeters, try to make the handle be 35 centimeters. Then stick them together with masking tape. Line everything with tape. That way it will be more resistant. And close one of the two ends. Now close one end of the large roll with tape. And paint a black dot to mark the center. Then stick the handle on that end. Don't fall short of tape. Fill the handle with toilet paper. To make it easier for you, you can push it with a brush. If you think it is a little loose, you can reinforce it with the tape. Now close the upper end of the bat with tape, and so that the tip is rounded, stick a ball of toilet paper over it. Wrap the cap with toilet paper and stick it well, then attach it to the end of the handle and wrap it up. We already have the structure made. Now the second step have on hand. White glue, a glass of water, a mixing bowl, a brush, and toilet paper. In a bowl add two parts of white glue, and a part of water to harden the entire structure. Stir with the brush. Put the mixture on the bat and glue sheets of toilet paper to make three layers. Then wait for it to dry. Tick tock to tick tock. Let's go to the third step. For this, you will need a glue gun, acrylic paint out brown, light brown, and red, a container of cardboard to mix the paints, and again, a brush. Start by painting the handle dark brown. Then have light brown details so that it has different shades. Do the same with the main part of the bat. Your fingers might get painted at some point, but do not worry.
When you have it, pick the top with red paint. As if it were blood. With the glue gun, make drops of blood dripping down the back. When it is dry, print it with red paint. Great. In this last step, you will repeat some ingredients. For example, a brush, the hot glue gun, the mixing bowl, silver and red paint, and thread. Use the thread as a very family friendly wire, painted silver. Cut the thread in two, a piece longer than the other. From the smallest thread, put a few pieces and knot it to the longer thread, simulating wire skewers. Finally, we rolled it up. We glued to the back and had a little more blood. And here we have the Battle Seal of the Walking Dead. Zombies better watch out. And that's it for today's I Tell You How. If you liked it, give it a like and let us know in the comments what you would like us to do in the next I Tell You How. Until next time.